Hi, I'm Jerry with Fit and 42. A big part of our lives is our story. You know, whether it's true or not, what we think every day kind of creates our story. Let me tell you about my story. I was born to a drug addict, alcoholic parents. Um, I have a brother, luckily. And at a very early age, my parents divorced. My dad got clean and he got custody of my brother and myself. My dad married four wives throughout the years and my brother and I, we uh, were subjected to a lot of mental abuse throughout the years and a feeling of we weren't very important. A feeling that all of my dad's wives were so much more important than my brother and myself. Later on in my life, my early 20s, my mother died of a drug overdose. Uh, that was really hard for me. Just a feeling of loss and not having your mother and then growing up and uh, being in a, in a broken home, but it all worked out for me. It's part of my story, it's who I am. Now luckily I had my brother to lean on throughout the years. I had him to, to go to and, and to be with when times were really tough for us. I was very fortunate to have a lot of friends, great friends, best friends, and their families took me in and they kind of knew, they knew what was going on at home and they, they kind of, they opened up their doors and I could spend as much time at their places as I needed to. You know, that's my story. I could have went at a very young age and I could have went crazy. I could have went the drug route. I could have went the alcohol route. It's in my blood, right? I could have went off the deep end. I could have went to crime. I could have rebelled. I could have said, you know, life's not fair. Hanging out with people that bettered me and supportive and, and uplifted me, that's why I am where I am today. I had a support system. I had people I could lean on, and that's my story. You know, fast forward, um, owned gyms out in the Coachella Valley, California, for almost 12 years now, my brother. We moved out here, and we got, you know, we got motivated. We always wanted to own businesses, and what better to help people, to help people that are going through tough times in their lives with their health and their fitness and their image and their self-worth. That's my story. I got a, went to a fork in the road and I was able to take a turn and say, you know what, I'm not gonna let it bring me down, my past. What's your story? How do you feel about yourself? Did you go through a breakup? You're feeling worthless. You're feeling like nobody wants you. You're feeling down on yourself. Do you lose a job? You're feeling like life is, is, is what's the point? Do you, lose, do you lose a loved one and someone pass away in your life? You know, our stories are like, it's, it's not necessarily true. You know, we all have a past. We all have things that happen to us, but do we, do they have to define who we're going to be? So here we are, Fit and 42. It's our way to help people define their new stories. It's our way to get people to be surrounded by support, surrounded by people who care, and surrounded by people that won't let them fail. That's what Fit and 42 is. And it's, it, it's surrounded by exercise, exercise and health. Getting yourself to feel better about yourself, getting healthy, working on yourself, and being positive and being surrounded by people that are positive and will uplift you. That's what we do here at Fit and 42. So if you need help, if you need help with your story, if you're feeling down on yourself and you're kind of lost, reach out to us. That's what we do. We help people change their story. That's what Fitin42 is. So, thank you so much. Give us a call. Visit fitin42.com for more information. And uh, thanks for listening to my story.